Hey guys, welcome back. This is the lecture number 54 from our bootcamp series. In this lecture, we're going to discuss about has many association in trails. Has many association is used to indicate a one to many relationship between two models. To implement this more association, we need to use has many macro into the model which we want to use as parent model and has many is always used inside the model which is treated as the parent model and the other model which can be considered a child model must have belongs to macro defined in it. This has one and belongs to combination forms a one to many relationship between two models. Now the has many associations indicates a one to many connection with uh, another model and its instance of the model has zero or more instances of another model. What is the meaning of here like uh, zero or more instances of another model? For example, as we discussed in the last video that uh, every post can have multiple comments, but it is also possible that nobody no post can have any comments. For example, if you have posted something and nobody has uh, provided any comment on that. In that case, your post model has zero comments, but it is also possible that there are n users who are commenting on that post. It means that the post also has multiple comments. So the model which is defining has many association can have zero or more instances of another model or its child model. Okay. So for this uh, to understand this has many association let's look at an example here uh, you can see the code snippet at my screen that uh, we have two active record models post and comments okay where post has defined has many comments and comment belongs to post we will see uh, about the belongs to association in the next lecture uh, but for the reference or for to better understand the example we are using post and belongs to here sorry post and comment model with one to many implementation here okay the model defining belongs to association must have the primary key of model defining has many association as a foreign key so what i mean here that uh, your post models primary key must be a foreign key into the comments model Okay, or you can say that uh, ID of a post must be stored inside the comment model to identify that from which post this comment belongs to. Okay, so here you can see that say that a post has many comments and comment belongs to post. So to implement this uh, relationship, we need to store post models primary key or post tables primary key into the comments model as a foreign key okay and to use that foreign key you can use model name underscore id so if you want to implement such relationship then you have to use post underscore id inside the comments table as a foreign key okay and we will uh, look at the concept of the primary key and foreign key later in some other video but uh, for now just keep in mind that to implement uh, a one to many association you need to use has many in the parent model and belongs to in the child model and then id of the parent table must be stored as a foreign key inside the child table okay so that's all about the uh, briefly we define here about has many association in the next lecture we will look at belongs to model which is required along with has many to form a one to many relationship between two real world entities or two active record models okay so we will look at the belongs to association inside uh, uh, into the next lecture uh, okay and we will also implement a one to many relationship between a student and a blog model okay so that's all from this lecture let's meet into the next lecture with belongs to association and implementation of one to many relationships thanks for watching this till then tata goodbye take care and stay safe